This is my son's new DSi to replace his lost DS Lite. This is the box. Very nice. When I first got this box it was really heavy and I thought there must be a brick in it or maybe there are two game consoles in there or something but it turns out that the heaviest thing in the box is the user manual. Can you imagine that? And that, that section from there onwards, that's English. Imagine having to read all of that before you can play a game. In the box you also have a uh, card with an invitation to some kind of club. A uh, health and safety guide. I don't know what hazards there are. It's apparently not safe to play this device. And a uh, quick start guide in four different languages. You also get a complimentary stick and a charger. And I was interested to see that uh, this little plug will not fit on the DS Lite. And finally you have the DSi. It looks pretty much the same as the DS Lite. A few differences. One is there's no Game Boy port. Uh, there is no start button on the side. Obviously there's a camera. Um, these things there are the speakers. There are some status indicator lights. The power button is here and not on the side. And that is a camera and a microphone. And on the outside you also have a camera and that little thingy there is a is a light that lights up when the outside camera is in use probably for privacy purposes. There's your standard uh, plug for the card and you can put some kind of a, a lanyard in there for the power. Uh, volume and brightness control is on this side and no longer at the bottom. Standard buttons for this thing. Oh, and uh, an extra stick. And that's it. Open it up. That's the DSi.